on 11th August, Evgeny Prudnik uploaded a video, arm wrestling without steroids, it's possible or not. And after that, we saw him beating Dadikyan in a left-handed match in an absolute war. He did better against Dadikyan than what Prime Morozov did. There are two things that can be said about that match. Dadikyan's arm got injured, that's why he wasn't able to perform at his best. But I will say that it was Prudnik's power that did that to Dadikyan. And number two, you get long-lasting benefits from steroid usage. Going clean right before a super match doesn't really make you a natural athlete. It would have been better if Prudnik clarified when he started taking them and when he stopped. But still, these things need to be appreciated more. Even Auden Lerret commented under that video. He appreciated Prudnik being natural. Prudnik can be one of the few natural arm wrestlers that are entertaining to watch and can still win at the top level. In one of the live streams, Engin said that Prudnik will not be over 105 kilos. He didn't use the word ever again, but I'm getting that he tried to say that. And that was a conclusion that Engin got after a private conversation with Prudnik. So it shows that Prudnik is planning on being natural and in fact he made it kind of clear when he started taking steroids. He told Engin in the podcast that he wants to be a natural arm wrestler just like before top 8. So maybe it was in 2018-19 when he started that. Engin used to talk about a super match between Prudnik and John Brzezink at 105 kilos. After Prudnik being natural, if he loses some strength with that, then maybe this match can happen. But I'll still say that it will be difficult for John to top roll Prudnik and beating him in a hook is near impossible. Even Levan said in the same interview that Prudnik's hook is really strong. Then they talked about the Ongarbayev match. Prudnik said that at that time in 2018, his hand and wrist was injured. That's why he wasn't able to perform well against Ongarbayev even though he was 111 kilos. He can still do better than that because now his hand and wrist are fine. After his right arm elbow injury, he wants to start with one level below. He told Engin that Dadikyan would be a good opponent for me. I think he wants to beat Dadikyan really bad. First left-handed and now right-handed. I think that match can be interesting and Prudnik can own the 105 kilo division if Devon doesn't go down there. When he talked about his chances being 50% against Devon in a rematch, that's kind of far-fetched. I don't believe it to be true. But Prudnik is an absolute beast. I never made a video about that when Prudnik said he's going natural. I think I wanted to appreciate that fact more. So here's the video. Thanks for watching. Like the video and subscribe.